Hello. In this video, we're going to cover audio and video connections for Zoom meetings on the computer. When you first open a Zoom meeting, you may get this pop-up window asking you to choose an audio conference option. Depending on your situation, you may want to dial into your meeting with a phone, in which case there are phone numbers provided under phone call, or you may want Zoom to call your phone, or you can join with a microphone and speakers on your computer. For most people, this is the best option, and we can select automatically join audio by computer to save this preference. Once you're in the meeting, you can control your audio via the microphone icon in the lower left. You can click it to mute yourself, or select the arrow icon to change other settings, such as choosing between microphones and speakers plugged into your computer. In my case, I have a second display, a professional microphone, and headphones set up so there are quite a few options. We do recommend using headphones and a microphone closer to your voice for better audio quality. If you have earbuds or AirPods with a microphone built in, those will do. If you use the microphone on your laptop, it may pick up more ambient sound and room echo, reducing the quality of sound for your audience. Audio issues are some of the most common problems people experience when video meeting. So Zoom has an interactive diagnostic for you called Test Speaker and Microphone, which can help you verify that your setup is working before showtime. Test one, two, test one, two. Test one, two, test one, two. Those are the basics of audio. Now let's cover video. Click the video button on the bottom left to turn on or off your webcam. Your built-in webcam will work fine for remote teaching. But if, like me, you have a separate display connected, you may have multiple cameras to choose from. There are a few handy settings to be aware of. If you want to get rid of your webcam background, you can choose a virtual background. This feature works with or without a green screen, but if you happen to have a green screen laying around, it will work even better. A few more of the video settings are useful to know about. If you click Video Settings, here you can toggle between webcams, enable HD video streaming if your connection is strong, and set some preferences around how video is displayed during your meetings. Those are some of the basics of audio and video connections for Zoom meetings on your computer.